drama at the Pacific Science Center today as an unidentified man scaled Seattle's iconic Space Needle and attached an enormous banner to its spire. And all the meaning of the flag symbol and the identity of the banner man both remain mysteries. What is clear is that Seattle's bioterrorist population... Banner man. <laughs> Pretty lame, right? Yeah, I just heard. And can we please not use the B word? What? Bioterrorist? Yeah. You know, that's just a slur invented by the DUP to make people scared of Congress, man. Look, whatever you want to call him, let's just track him down. Find out what he can tell us about Augustine. And drain his powers. Okay, fine. And drain his powers. I'm telling you, it's gonna work. All right. They just found a body in Fifth and Briar. Go check it out. But promise me, you'll be inconspicuous. Yeah, listen, Delson, it, it's gonna be police officers in this crime scene, okay? Not DUPs. Now, I'm here to support you, but killing cops. I got it, I got it. I'll put my phasers on stun. Okay, I did it your way. I'm past your boys in blue. Thank you. Although, what's the use of having smoke powers if you're not gonna use them? Ah, there's my well, baby brother. Found the victim. Definitely the work of a conduit. It's very showy. Okay, I need you to take a couple pictures of the crime scene and send them to me. Anything that might give us a lead. There's your wounds. I wonder what kind of power did this? Fire blast or lasers? Ooh, what about flesh-eating death gaze? <laughs> I wouldn't mind absorbing a little flesh-eating death gaze, right? <sighs> Delson, even if the guy who did this is a prime conduit, we still don't know if this power transfer thing's even gonna work. Well... <sighs> You know what, if it does, my first victim, it's gonna be the guy who came up with the name Banner Man. Bro, you really need to let that go. Okay, sending you the picture, but I think he blinked. Uh, Reg, I'm hearing sirens, man. Yeah, let me check real quick. Yeah, the DUP's just cordoned off the area. I've warned the Seattle PD to stay away. It has to be the conduit. I'll check it out. There's right. gonna be a lot of DUP there. You really want to catch this guy. Another reputation wow. on the line well, here. Yeah, well, so is mine. No, nothing. That must not have had a record. <laughs> From the looks of the guy, I at least would have expected a drug bust or two. was awesome!
No, it's get the conduit! Ease! And good luck with that. Conduit sure got a certain style. Kind of nouveau sick. Okay, I just need... Let me guess, face and wounds. If it's not too much trouble. All right, there you go. Stand by for wounds. No need. I got a hit on the face. Guy's a drug dealer. Rap sheet's a mile long. Look around for his stash. Might give us a clue why the sniper chose him. Holy sh Holy what? What holy? Delson, are you okay? Yeah. Found our sniper going after him. Be careful. Wait, 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 wait. Don't impale me. I come in peace. It's okay. It's okay. I'm one of you. I mean, one of us. You slow down! I'm not gonna hurt you! God, especially if you don't slow down. Stop! Come back! Nice meeting you. You get him? No, he ran fast, like... Like, really, really fast. Conduit fast, man. Screw flesh-eating death gaze. I want that. Now, don't be greedy. Funny thing, man. I, just before every shot, you could see the neon sign behind him dim a little. Uh, must be his power source. Uh, head back to the sign. See what you can find. You should see what this guy can do, man. Like lasers or something. I'm telling you, it would be great to have a one-two punch like that and smoke when I get to Augustine. Take it easy. We've got to find him again first. Ah, yeah! All right, I'm here. Any idea what I should be looking for? Just anything that might well, help with who our sniper is. Well, one thing this place tells us is that our sniper is a sniperette. Wait, what? You should see this, Reg. It's like the girliest sniper's nest you've ever seen. What? What does that even mean? I, I don't know. It's just girled up. Girl stuff. Like the name Brent burned into the wall in girly handwriting. And it is... Definitely the best smelling assassin's den you could ever be in. Okay, uh, look, just send me photos of anything you think might help. Okay, those definitely very likely belong to a woman. Like you know. Like, seriously? A serial killer who reached Jane Eyre? Oh, totally. Jane Eyre is like the female catcher in the rye. Okay, I can see how you might think those are women's shoes. Yeah, they're like size negative. I wonder who Brent is. I can't help you there. So, anything else interesting? Relax, I'm looking. I guess this counts as interesting. That's interesting, all right. You know, it's a long shot, but maybe if I run this through the database, cross-referencing the name Brent, I'll get lucky.
You know, if I had smoke and lasers, I could, like, put on light shows in our living room. Oh, that'd be putting your powers to good use. Hey, Reg, I was, uh, I was just thinking about the bras. Well, stop, okay? Seriously, just stop. Okay, I'm thinking, when I get to Augustine, it's gonna be like, whoom, smoke, and then once I got on the ropes, it's like, zap, zap, I'll whip out the laser show. It's good to have a plan. Hey, I got a hit on the photo. Name's Brent Walker. One arrest two years ago for minor drug possession. Get this, found dead two months later in an alley. Cause of death? A single puncture wound of unknown origin to the chest. I'm sending you the address now. Yeah, our girls definitely got a thing against drug dealers. <laughs> sure seems like it. It's weird though, man. If she's just killing drug dealers, then why do the news reports make it sound like she's picking off random victims like it could be anybody? Yeah? Well, you'd think the DUP would want people to know the killings weren't random. That if you're not a drug dealer, you're not in danger. That'd sure bring the panic level down. So you're saying what? The DUP is trying to scare people? I mean, their job is to control the panic. <laughs> All right, I'm at the alley, but there's a bunch of heavily armed dudes here. Looks like a drug deal's going down. I hate to go all cop on you, but it is the duty of every citizen to step up when they witness a crime in progress. So now you do want me killing people with my powers? I didn't say kill them, just rough them up, scare them a little, and destroy their stash. Nelson, I heard shots. Did you kill them? Hey, I was trying to do my duty as a citizen, man, but they were trying to do their duty as criminals. Fretch, you should see this man. Speedy gone crazy is a tagger. She's a pretty damn good one too. Yeah, well, don't forget she's a murderer, right? Pretty damn good one too. You really shouldn't leave lit candles unattended. She sets a lovely altar. It's actually kind of touching. Yeah, well, there's good touching and bad touching. Okay, she's good. Hey, maybe when you drain her powers, you'll suck up a little bit of her talent, too. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm telling you, man, this is gonna work. You gotta admit, girl makes a mean vortex. And now we come to the highlight of the tour. Okay, that is full bore crazy. Okay, so the girl stops off for takeout, comes here to sit with Neon Brent to tell him all about her day while she chowders down. And you know, Olaf's has a location on Alaskan Way. He's supposed to have one of the biggest neon signs in the city. Hey, if I had neon powers and a chowder Jones, that's where I'd hang. I'm on my way.
Hey, mister. Sign our petition to get drugs off the streets? Unless we stop this poison, more of our youth will turn out like Fetch Walker. Fetch Walker? Her body was corrupted by drugs, and the drugs turned her into a bioterrorist. We need your help to keep our streets clean of that kind of filth. Filth, huh? Hey, you're either fighting with us or against us. What's the name of that book? You know, the one that says, uh, let he who is without sin cast the first... Country, Delson. Oh, Reg. Didn't know you were there. Did I just butt dial you? People have a right to speak their mind without being attacked. It was self defense, man. They had signs and pamphlets. You know, on second thought, you would be a hell of a lot less conspicuous staked out near the restaurant's neon sign, all right? She's sure to reload off of it, and you wouldn't give yourself away by picking stupid fights on the sidewalk. They started it. Just go. Okay, just need a place to hide. Okay, this is good. Surveillance. Hobo style. Oh man, that smells good. Why didn't I take some cash off those dealers? Money, why do you hate me? Be my friend, Money. Come to me. Let's bond. No! It's okay! God! Ah, not this again. Just like last time, Delson. Concentrate. Oh, no, 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 no. You're not getting away. I got this now. Just leave me alone! Run up walls? <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. what I came to do! Damn, she's fast! I am not going back to Curtin K! Come on! Come on! You've got to calm down, all right? Just relax. You're not taking me wanna... back! I am not going back to Curtin K!
good news is, less juice for her. Bad news, I'm not a night person. Well, maybe stop trying to kill me, and we can let the beer signs live to see another day. That was awesome. Not anymore. Listen to me, I'm not with Augustine. You're one of a goddamn robot. How many times? Wait, are there really robots? I just want some of your powers, that's all. Just leave me alone! I know you're in there. Surprise! Oh, I, I am, am so going gonna use back. this. You can run, but you can't hide. Where the hell are you? As a little girl, I never thought it'd be me. That I'd be one of them. My powers were a surprise. My parents turned me in. They knew what the government would do to people like me, and they did it anyway. I didn't know what to do, but my brother Brent just grabbed our coats, and we ran. Those were hard days on the street. Moving from city to city, no comfort anywhere. Until we met some dealers, and man, they hooked us up. The drugs. The drugs were heaven. But then we always wanted more. And the withdrawal, agony. Always looking for a fix. And when you lose your stash, when you think someone stole it from you, the drugs, the dealers, they make you do things they... The government picked me up easy enough after that. But it wasn't a regular jail. They trained me to shoot, taught me how to kill. So 
on the day of the crash. I escaped with all those skills. Everything I needed to set things right. Brent, I promise, every dealer I find, I'm gonna burn your name in their chest. No one else is gonna suffer like we did. No brother. Nobody else. You did good, buddy. Come on. Get up. Get up. Oh. Whoa. Hey, you did good. I know just where to put filth like this. Somewhere where Augustine won't find her, and she won't be hurting anybody else. Hey, no, 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 no. She's just killing drug dealers, man. Killing? Nelson, murdering drug dealers. What do you think I'm doing to the DUP? What you have to to save the Akomish back home. She stays free. No. Dude, no way! Look, just because you have the same affliction, not gift, affliction, doesn't mean that we're gonna pick up every little piece of trash we find. Look, I'm never going to abandon you, all right? Not ever. This one goes in a cage. Hey! Conduits. It's my call. Not yours, not ours. My. Oh, really? So Mr. Freewheeling Badass finally wants to take on some responsibility. And for what, huh? A bioterrorist with a body count? I love you, Rez. Don't make me break that handsome nose of yours. Bye. Hope she kills someone's father tomorrow. Or mother the day after that. You're the one that allowed that to happen. You calm down. Yeah. Let's talk. All right, Reg, sorry, I... Oh, look who it is. What, is the meeting of the Conduit Club finally over? I just wanted to talk to her, okay? To see if maybe she could help us out? Oh, you are not doing the pouting Reggie thing, are you? No, I hate that! Look, you know someone like that shouldn't be free to roam the streets. Uh, are you forgetting who else is someone like that? Not the same, you're different. Yes, I know, I'm your brother. And your brother is asking for your help and trying to stay alive. If you won't do it for me, then do it for the tribe. Fine. What do you need? Thank you. I need to see what else this new power can do, and you are my go-to guy when it comes to finding the core relays. There. I sent it. For the tribe and you. Thank you. I'll let you know what I get. No, I don't want to know what you get. Bye, pouting Reggie. Hey, Fetch, you know those glowing boxes the dupes put up all over town? Yeah, I've seen them. I think they can track us with them. Well, I think I figured out a way to use them to, like, tap into more powers for me. I was gonna try it out on the new neon power you gave me. Gave you? And I thought maybe you'd like to tag along, you know, maybe talk me through the new stuff. I already bagged my dealer limit for the day, so why the hell not? And there's my sweet girl. Screw you. Okay, there's supposed to be one of those things at, uh, second in Maine. Yeah, I've seen it before. Meet you there. Really moved. 